What's up everybody? Today I'm bringing you a quick review of the Viking Bags Large Motorcycle Backpack. It's sporting a stealth design with no carbon fiber or huge logos, but what it lacks in looks, it makes up for in features. Here's a list of some of the features you'll find in this bag. It's constructed of heavy duty cordura with reflective piping on the side pockets for additional nighttime visibility. It uses a comfortable two buckle harness system with padded shoulder straps and tons of adjustability points. In addition to pockets on the side, it has two pockets on the back for small electronics like an MP3 player and quick access to important documents. On the inside, there are a ton more pockets. Quick tip, but make sure you don't tell anyone. But if you want to go full stealth and change out the logo, you can actually unscrew the Viking Bags logo from the inside and swap it out with your own. And here's a closer look at the inside pockets. It has a dedicated laptop pocket with a dedicated Velcro strap, as well as various other compartments. The website states that a 15-inch laptop is able to fit in the padded compartment, but I wasn't able to fit my 2011 15-inch MacBook Pro in there. Maybe the newer and slimmer laptops might fit, but mine didn't work. I was able to fit it in the main compartment though. And by far the best feature of this bag would have to be the built-in parachute, you know, for when you find yourself 20 to 30 feet up in the air off your bike. <laughs> just kidding. It's a helmet harness and it's a simple yet genius design. You just pull out the harness from underneath the bag, put your helmet on your bag, then hook the clamps onto the top hook and boom, you're done. Now you can carry a spare helmet for that special someone in your life. As much as I've enjoyed using this bag, there are some changes I would love to see. So Viking Bags, if you're watching this, I would love to see more reflective piping around the bag so you stand out even more. Also, please make the side pockets larger. There's wasted real estate on the sides of the bag. You're only able to fit cash, ID cards, GoPro batteries, or maybe a small pocket knife, but definitely no cell phones. Lastly, I like the addition of the rubber strap holder on the bottom, but I would like to see that rubber strap also added to the other straps as well to ensure that there's nothing flying around in the wind while riding. Overall, this is an excellent sub $100 motorcycle backpack and I would highly recommend it. I'll leave a link to the backpack on the Vikings website in the description below. The holidays is right around the corner so this will make a perfect gift for any motorcyclist in your family. If you have any questions or just want to say hi, leave them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching and make sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.